Talk Man. about the animal. Let's talk about John yeah. Rambo. You're all dead. Um, okay, listen. Here's here's what Riley we need to and I didn't see it. No, you know, we, it, can't we did not. Again. We'll just go under the table. First question: If you've never seen a Rambo movie, can you enjoy it? Yes. Second question: Should you see all the Rambo movies before seeing this movie? Yes, um, because you will have so much more of an experience <sighs> watching it. It Some is good call box. Look, it's mm. not fucking Casablanca. Yeah, it's not. It's not Citizen Kane. Yeah. That's why when I say, also, well, then I'm out. Yeah. It's it's also not pretending to be. No. Like, no. Why anybody would compare it's that? Eight minutes. Yeah. yeah. And phenomenal, wow. and I'll tell you because the thing is, it's all about it's it's like what you want old grouchy Rambo to be, and the, yes. the, without giving away too much, the, the story itself is that Rambo at the end of Rambo Four, mm -hmm. he walks up to his ranch in Arizona, and he starts his new life. So when we see him today, he, he is on the he's got the short haircut now. No first, long hair. No, it's first time he's had a short haircut in the history of the franchise. But well, that's just Rocky Balboa running around. No, he's Shut civilized up. now. And then my mother-in-law goes up to him and says, "Do you like your hair that way?" Yeah, that's right. <laughs> nice and then he stabs yeah. her in the face. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, uh, yeah, yeah, you like it now. <laughs> he takes a sawed-off shotgun and blows off half of her head. Yeah. Yeah. So, so How do you like your hair? Rambo um, is now looking after this 16, 17-year-old girl yeah. and, and her grandmother, and he's just kind of protecting her and making sure that she just stays innocent and pure because that's what kept him kind of civilized. Um, and there's just one line that we have to talk about because yeah. it's the best. She wants, you know, the, the story is that she wants, she finds out where her real dad is and she wants to go find him. And in Rambo, Mexico. Yeah, Rambo goes, he, he, he's a bad guy, he's got black heart, you don't know. And, she, and she's just like, no, 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 you've changed. He goes, I haven't changed. I just have a lid on it. And yeah. McCougar and I went, yes! No! Oh, awesome! Oh, it's gonna fucking happen! Oh, I love shit like that. We know it's coming. We yeah. know it's coming. <laughs> Remember back in the day when you're like, your parents used to put popcorn on the pot on the oh, yeah. stove? Oh, yeah. All of a sudden, it's like a lid. Yes. Yes. You yeah. saw you're the like, popcorn when, inside of Rambo. Just, yeah, you're, you're, you're like, just, you just went. So the movie, you know, it, 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 it goes through its thing. You're watching it and you're understanding, okay, that's what they're setting up. They're setting up. And then you're there for the last 20 minutes of the movie. Um, I, I liked every second, every part of it, watched it. And I'm like, okay, okay, where do we want to and when you get to the 20 minutes that oh you're waiting for, my God. we were hooting and hollering yes. like we were. It, it was a victory. It was incredible. It, it, oh. it was the last 20 minutes alone. That's why you go. And when you see the 47% or whatever, 57% on Rotten Tomatoes, should you be discouraged? No, because those are non Rambo fans. It's the if if that I think means there are forty three percent of people out there who are absolute freaking morons. No, no, no. <laughs> I would, I would I'm go, kidding. I'm I wouldn't. Kidding. I wouldn't do that. I'm just saying. That just not, this is. It's <laughs> if you're reviewing it like a film. It's gonna get a forty-seven percent. Sure. Yeah. If you're reviewing it as a Rambo film, 100. it's fucking 85, 90, 95 percent. Yes. It's Josh, a Rambo film. Josh went straight for hundred. It's an arc for what his character is doing. It's an arc from where you start from first blood to where you are now with him and what he has to do. And there's certain things that they, they introduce that never really go back nope. to ever again. But nope. I didn't care because I the last give twenty two minutes. Shits. You yeah. you loved it as much. Oh as my it. god. Yeah. Okay. Here's the best part. Is like at the beginning, and I think Chris and I were thinking the same thing. There's a lot of talking. And yeah. I'm like, all right, when is he going to start freaking killing some people? <laughs> <laughs> what the hell is happening? Right. They're setting you and up. It, they are. It. And I, I, I've said it, I said it a couple days ago. The crescendo of this movie yes. is literally like you stepped in. You're like, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the uh, fifth playing of Beethoven's Eighth Symphony. Which is like, dun, 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 dun. and then out walks fucking Eddie Van Halen. And he's just like, it really is like that. Fooled you. <laughs> oh, <laughs> my God. That's like, great. Yes. And, and I will say oh. that everybody involved in the movies is really, really good. And the the, the young girl, I wish I knew her name. So she was she's she was great. Really endearing. Uh, pa has you, Vegas in there for like has ten Vega. minutes. Uh, Makuga turns turns around and goes. Spanglish. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's right. She wasn't Spanglish. That's right. Uh, oh, Johnny Spanglish. It's a great movie. movie. But the I other props Spanglish. you're going to love here, too. No. Roka, Roka undersold this. Yeah. Brian Tyler does the music again, <gasps> and it's incredible. Yep. Because if you are a original fan of, uh, of Jerry Goldsmith's theme, yeah. it's – because I asked Roka. I, I, I said, do they have the theme? Roka goes, yeah. Roka goes in, the, in the very beginning. It's throughout the entire movie. There's just renditions of, of it throughout the entire movie. The ent I was listening. The entire movie, there's new – the end, at one point, it kicks into Rambo 2. Bum, 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 bum. 
bum, 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 bum. And yes. Like, yes. And there's, like, uh, yeah. there's a, a training montage, if you will, uh, you know, what Stallone is famous for. That is two training montages. There's two, yeah, there is two. <laughs> fuck, you're right. There is two training montages. <laughs> Shit. Yeah. Uh, and <laughs> that you're just like you're on pins and needles because you know what's going to happen. You, know it. you just don't know when and how. And, and how. when it does, woo! Yeah. But here's the best part. So there's one part. I'm not going to give away anything. There's a part, and Christian's like, "That wasn't a very good plan." I was like, "Let's see what happens." Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but, and it wasn't a very good plan, it but, it, but it sets up other things. But there's something that from the very beginning of this movie. Something is introduced, and you go, "Well, that's going to come into play yeah. later." And, yeah. sh- and boy, does it! Uh, and, I love yeah. that it sounds like you two were chatting the whole time. Oh yeah, <laughs> Spanglish! <laughs> I know that wasn't a good plan. All Just four, wait. All four of us. All yeah. four of us are going yeah. back and forth. I wonder why Bibiani didn't like it. Uh, <laughs> no, 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 we were like yelling at Bibiani's ear. He was sitting right in front of me, and I was like, yeah. what? Bring, "All right, let's let's take a bet. We're going to okay. go Bibiani's tweets if he tweeted anything out about it." Okay. I think because it's it, to me, it seems like it's going to be typical. Bibiani to not like it, yeah. but I might be wrong. You might love it. Uh, what do you think? I think he will not like it. Mm, I don't think you'll like it. I don't think he's a Rambo fan. I think I, he's I part would of say the based solely on his movement during the entire movie, I would say it's a no. And normally when he really likes the, that stuff, he's, he's very vocal yeah. and making loud noises in the theater. Uh, he didn't make a peep. He didn't move. We were you might also have been making so much noise That's that you true. couldn't hear anybody else. But Guy, Guy and Bateman and I were all, and, and McCougar, it was just like bum, 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 bum. Let's just yeah. say so if Becca fun. M. Ford was sitting by us, she would not have been no. pleased. But it, yeah. we were, we, I don't think we were, we weren't no. too loud. We, I mean, we just, but that's actually, I love... Uh, energy like that yeah. in a movie, yeah. I really do. The whole I think yeah. theater was that's like what I'm that. saying. When the whole theater is like, yeah. like that's just it's so fun because it's so taboo. Because the setup was when they set it up, it, it, it goes into like Makuka said, I think brilliantly, like it's just this rhythm that you're just like, okay, 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 and then when you get to that 20 minutes, the whole theater, like, <laughs> 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 and it's like it was you could you could feel it because like the like something would happen or you know you know something a kill happens and then. There's like this, like oh my god, from one side of the theater, and then it just catches on yeah. the whole theater. I, I want to see this like, movie in front of everyone, yes, yes. <laughs> yeah. like the whole world. Legitimately, not to use my symphony reference again, but it was like a little ten year old was playing like the timpani drums. Then in walks Tommy Lee. Just yeah. like, are you, boom, are you boom, looking boom. at his tweets? <laughs> yeah, he didn't tweet about it. He didn't tweet. No, so he didn't like it. I don't know. He didn't. Well, if you like it, you would have, yeah. right? Not sure. Uh, not sure. I walked. I walked. I, I was talking to a man on the way home. She's like, how was Rambo? I was like, all right, so here's what happened. He, he's got a horse. And yeah. we're like, where do you get the horse? And then she's like, all right, calm down. Same thing. So we, we like, I got to I'm driving. Rambo. We got out of there. We're walking back downstairs to the uh, parking lot before I showed my skills. Yeah. And uh, and Makuga goes, we're like, it, we're like it's 8.45. Yeah. And like, we got into that movie at 7 o'clock, seven. out by eight, out yeah. by eight thirty, really. Yeah. And and then he's like, you, he's like, you can tell Sadie when you get back. The reason why is because Rambo just killed everybody. And I, like, <laughs> yeah. I, like, I was like, I'm gonna use that. Why so, did the movie end so soon? Everybody died. Yeah. So I get I get back <laughs> in. I walk <laughs> in. I'm like, I'm setting it up. I'm like, can't wait. She's gonna go. Why are you home so early? I'm waiting for it. And never happened. And then finally, towards the end, I'm like, are you going to know why I'm home so early? Because Rambo killed everybody. Am I right? <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey. And she goes. I never asked. Yeah. yeah. So I'm like, all oh, right. She's like, what do you want for dinner? <laughs> 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 Tomorrow. <laughs> yeah. It's the fucking conversation in our house every Like, day. here's the thing. God bless her, Christian. Just, it's like, what are we doing for dinner? You want it's a conversation in my house, too. Yeah, okay. it's, 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 it takes hours. It's, it, it's, it takes too long. It, I, I, it's like, I, I said, what are you guys in the mood for? What are you in the mood for? I will eat anything. Yes. Well, it's funny that you ended up having tacos because you had said to her, she was like, do you feel like Mexican again? And he goes, not really. I'm like, ooh, you oh, know ooh. what? You know who doesn't ooh. get a vote? The person ooh. that's not cooking <laughs> it. Yeah, right, yeah. That's who doesn't get a yeah, vote. Uh, I, know. <laughs> yeah. I don't care. Yeah. But it, her, the tacos are delicious. The, uh, um, uh, I was trying to think of like on the way home how I would compare <laughs> the Johns. Because remember the, the yesterday or the day before, the John Matrix, John McClane, John right, Rambo, right, yes, John yes, Wick, yes, yes. right? So John Wick is a ballerina with weapons. Yeah, okay? right. Like yeah. He, he's just yeah. a he's a ballet artist. It's a, it's a modern. There take. was some sliding. There was a couple there was of slides. Some sliding. Okay. John Matrix is literally a bull in a china shop. Just yep. like watch right. out. You know, get out of the way. Get out of the way. John McClane luckily won. Right, right, like right. He, he, he just, falls into he the right. He falls yeah, into yeah, the yeah. right thing. He's, he's, he's like, first one. Then. But, but yeah, you know who we forgot though, and Heidi, Frosty, Heidi, and Frank brought this up this morning. John Adams should have been a fatal five. <laughs> John no, Quincy Adams. John, John, John Quincy. Been good. No, yeah. Jason Bourne. Oh uh, yeah, but Jason his name's Bourne. not John. Yeah, that's what we're doing. John. It was John. John. I got it now. <laughs> 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 that words are great. John Bourne is his friend's called. Out of the four Johns, fuck. 
<laughs> yeah. <laughs> but John, 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 John Cena. <laughs> that's I mean, true. Or John yeah, Cena. Actually, we haven't seen John Cena in that perfect action movie yet, where he's like has his franchise. And don't give me the Marine. And nobody's seen those movies unless you're a WWE fan or numbnuts over here. Numbnuts McGillicuddy. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Yeah, yeah. But John Rambo, like if John Wick is a ballerina with a weapon, John Rambo is he is like the uh, the mom planning the meal for Thanksgiving. He's just oh, like I'm okay. gonna do this, 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 and this. Rambo, and everybody yeah. sits down, they'll all be pleased with the meals in front of them, and John oh, Rambo's yeah. just like, <laughs> he, you know what he's like? He's Macaulay Culkin in Home Alone, but just like, way, a thousand times yeah. more violent, right, obviously, right. and it's always silly. Although, but it's like, although, there was these guys that did this, uh, the effects, it's on YouTube, and they made Home Alone a rated R movie. Oh, yeah, and like, yeah, so yeah. Daniel Stern, when he steps on the, the nail, you see his foot like explode with blood, <laughs> and they actually put like meat inside of it, and you see him holding his foot, and the meat's hanging out, and like, and then, I got it. and yeah. when, and when he, sh- when he shoots, when he this. shoots yeah. Joe Pesci or Dan Stern in the head, head with the BB gun, his yeah. head blows off. <laughs> and it's, like, it's, it's, it's really, and he's just, and they put like like menacing music behind it, yeah. and oh. it's like, it seems like a horror movie with Kevin McAllister. Like, I love this. I killed everyone. Yeah, yeah but. I mean, here's the thing, John Wick. You know he's gonna kill everybody, right? He doesn't really have much. He has sort of remorse a little bit. John. McClane doesn't kill everybody, but he does, like, sort of does, right? Uh, John Rambo, like, his enjoyment of the killing is what you really get. Like, he, there, he, he knows what he's good at. Yes. It's like the switch. When the switch goes on, get yes. lost. Just get... Because uh, that's well, that's the theme in every Rambo movie, right? It's like the switch is off in the beginning of, of the first, first blood. blood. Oh, and yeah. then it gets on, and it's like, oh, shit. Yeah. Right? And same thing. Number two, just take pictures, John. Do yeah. we just want to see the POWs? Just take pictures. No. Nope. Sees the POWs. They're being treated as poorly. Boom. Switch goes on. Yeah. Third one. Fourth one. Switch goes on. Go, go, Get go, the go, go, fuck go. out of the way. Yeah. Once yeah. that switch is gone. Dude, we, I'm not going to spoil the thing, but as we both said as we were walking out of the movie, as soon as those bad guys saw the one thing, we're like, you should have just turned around and, and gone back to Mexico. And left. Just go back to Mexico. Yeah. yeah. And left. Um, but yeah, man. So it was... It was uh, that... It, that is going to be that sound bite is about to be taken way out of context. Oh, right. You just going go back to Mexico. No, yeah, no, yeah, 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 yeah. Right, right. Do the war. Put, 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 no. put a red hat on. Like, you. Because they were from Mexico. <laughs> yeah, I uh, know. They came to America for the wrong reasons. Right. But uh, anyway, so go and go and check this movie out. John yeah. Rambo's that uh, wrong reason. It just uh, yeah, it's, it's oh, I can't wait. It's and when are you going to see it? You going to see it this weekend? I'm going to try to get her to go this. this well, is is it? Yeah, it comes out this yeah. weekend. It's a tough sell for her. Oh come on! You got to talk about. I it. would have to. I, w- I would have love to. I, gotta, I have to see the other ones first. Yeah. All right. That I mean, might be, maybe maybe we'll do. Now a, I want to do a watch along. I have them all. I have. I have them all. So maybe we'll, maybe we'll do a watch along on uh, the SEN. This is what I want to do. I yes, want to yes, sleep yes, train yes, your yes, child yes. for you. So I'm going to come over five nights in a row. Please stay the night. Okay. Cuddle Sadie. That sounds awesome. Oh what? what? I'm good. I'm going to sleep train your child, and all of those nights we can watch a Rambo. Oh yes, a Rambo. A Rambo. Uh, yeah, that's a One of the Rambos. <laughs> I, <laughs> oh, man. I'm, like, I'm, just I'm, thinking I'm waiting this. for it. I'm waiting for it. Cody says it. I, like, I want... So it's like an orchestra. Right okay. Yeah, I want to spoil there it. Is, so it's a There's piccolo. a little piece of writing in this movie. When I, I mean, there's not a ton of writing, per se. No. But he says was, the most in the first five minutes of the movie that he all has five. in all four Rambos. Yeah, yeah, Combined. Yeah. Yes. All of them. Um, he, there is a, an amazing like callback. Of writing with an action sequence that you rarely see in a movie. Oh, okay. I'm trying to remember. <laughs> he dials a rotary phone. phone. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> beep boop, beep boop. Yeah. Listen, drug dealers, you fucked with the wrong dude. Go, go, go. Knife in the tube. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Why did you just it do to it? his butt? <laughs> He grabbed he it. <laughs> oh, yeah. 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 like, I'm going to HR after this. Oh, you're t- I know what you're talking <laughs> about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Okay. Uh, I mean, you see that in the trailer. He's, he's definitely, yeah. he, there's there's callbacks to the the movies, the, the previous ones. As you can tell, it's for the it's for the hardcore Rambo fans for sure. Yeah. And fun. <laughs> and there are some really you know fun action movies. Uh, it's like you know kills and stuff at the end. That if totally. you just in, that writing Riley's gonna get kicked. Yeah, out. you're you're bringing back all the memories I have of watching yeah. Rambo. Like I would rewind. 
part two when, when the guys up. when the, when he has the arrow and the yeah. guy's running knowing he's going to blow up. I mean, I would watch that he over embraced, and over again, it. over and over because, again. Part three when he yeah. takes out the Apache so you're a psychopath helicopter. is what you're saying. <laughs> oh my god, I would just huh. I would just rewind these moments because Rambo was so cool. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I would take my you made it weird. in my hand. No. It was it weird. weird. It was yeah. real weird. Uh, anyway, can so, I ask? No. Yes. When we, okay, no. Thank you. Christian always says no. I'm going to stop asking to ask. Christian's a Foley artist, Foley artist, Foley artist, Foley. 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 They uh, make the. Oh, uh, yeah. I don't know. <laughs> there it goes. Dave. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's Dave Foley. It's people yeah. who draw Dave yes. Foley. Oh, cool. yes. yeah, they're Foley artists. I'm Dave Foley, so am I. I'm Dave Foley. When was the first Rambo movie? 1980. 82. Okay. So. It was called First Blood. First Blood. Okay. So. It's, Stupid. it's super vi- it's super violent, right? Do you feel like no. is it still enjoyable to watch? Like now that the effects are so much better than they were in eighty two. Fir- first blood, I feel I'll tell you what. Yeah. I bet you out of all the movies you really love First Blood. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. First blood it's is, like it's my, it's new. It's kind of he a only drama. kills one person in First Blood. Yeah. Okay. Be- in, uh, oh. Because the movie is more about him. Did re- they know when they made it they were gonna make more? No, no, because the movie. Well, the, this, here's, this is a story I told last night. Yeah. yeah, the book itself came out in 1972, and it was okay. a great book. It's a phenomenal book. I, if you have not read First Blood, 1972, David Morrell. David Morrell. It's yeah. incredible. The same way that what like, and I said this to you last night. The reason why Hunger Games hit was because you, the, the books. Yeah. It's because you were inside Katniss's head. Yes. And, and the thought process, and that's what happens with the book is, and it was 72, so the war was still going on yeah. at the time. So Rambo gets back to the States, and in the book, Brian Dennehy's character still kind of, you know, brings him in, wants to see what's going on, but he's not as much of a dick to him. He's more sympathetic to him. And Rambo in the movie kills one person. He when he runs out of the when he runs out of the police station, he punches or, or hits a guy in the nose, breaks the guy's nose, runs out. In the book, he guts the dude, okay. kills him, kills everybody. Mm-hmm. He kills everybody because he goes back into that yeah, mentality. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So by the end of the it, came he, up. Like it's, it's, he kills Dennehy, and Dennehy lives in the movie, but he kills Dennehy, and then Troutman kills Rambo. Mm. Um, there is a scene that you can find on YouTube where they actually shot First Blood where Troutman kills Rambo. Wow. But this is 1982, right, right around the same time that Rocky Three came out. Right. Yeah. And people are going, you can't kill Stallone. Right. right. And so they said, plus, we can make a second one. Yeah, and right. so that's exactly what they did, okay. and they turned it into a franchise. There was a Rambo cartoon. Oh, can you yeah. actually bring up Rambo cartoon prior to the movie or after the after movie? the movie? After like the not, movie. yeah, like okay. nineteen after like Rambo so they, two. So Rambo this, looks like Stallone. This just shows you the Reagan era, by the way. Oh, because, that's still the little. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is, no, Rambo shows up. Just give it a minute. Give it a minute. Rambo lives in that wall. Yeah, Rambo yeah he's, shows he's, up. Yeah. yeah, he's in the <laughs> he's in the vent. He kills here. all the littles. That's why they only have one season. <laughs> Rambo takes a knife and just yeah. 1983. Rambo that tracks. Put, there you go. Just put a Rambo <laughs> oh, cartoon wow. in the intro. No, oh, go to the second one. Second one. Uh, oh. The intro. Yep. Just, no, that's it right there. Uh, yeah. So here's the intro to it. No, that's 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 not it. Well, that's an F. But this is shows you the Reagan era because a guy who's this is like after the second one where he's brutally killing everyone. Let's give him a cartoon. And then yeah. you could sell his knife. I bought his knife. Oh, yeah. You wouldn't be able to do that. The plastic oh, yeah. knife? Or the yeah. Yeah. Do you remember that? Yeah, it was like well, the, the, the really. plastic thing yeah. with the knife and everything. I bought it. This is the opening to Rambo the oh, cartoon. I feel like it's also the opening to oh, yeah, and then, Mr. Mom. Listen, same music. Yeah, same music. They did not have Sloan's voice, though. Yeah. Oh, bulging, pulsing but muscles. But it's for kids, and it's like they would assume that kids had seen the movie. It was rated R. It would be amazing. This was in the morning, the show. <laughs> oh, my God. Nice. Well, yeah. This yeah. is the same shots from uh, yeah. part two. Yeah. 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 Oh my god. Isn't that amazing? That's oh, amazing. Look, he's got a tank. A tank, yep. And a dog. Forces of General Warhawk, threatening the peace loving people of the world. There's only one man to call. Get me Rambo. Oh my god, look <laughs> yeah. at him go. I wish this was canon. Yeah. From the canyons of skyscrapers to the canyons of remote mountain peaks. I love that he used the music. Wow. Amazing. That's yeah, and does anybody remember? Do you remember the series? No. No. Uh, yeah. yeah, you do, right? Oh, oh yeah. yeah. That's uh, so. The fact that they, they they made that they had um, 
it was very different from what they were supposed to do originally. Like to answer your question, like the '82 version, they probably said, "Okay, let's see what we did." And people responded to it, and so they made a second one because the second one came out in like '85. Yeah. Um, so do you feel like even the 85 one, if there is more, do you feel like the, the newer ones are more enjoyable because the effects are better? No, or, I, no. Think that, I think that it's, it, again, that there's something about the 80s action feel yeah. about it because like there's so many, someone, there's got to be a video of all the Rambo kills. There's got to be a video. Be. No, somebody got me. Yeah. What's your favorite uh, of the series? I've seen Rambo 2 so many times. Yeah. Rambo 2 Rambo is probably two is my awesome. favorite. I would go yeah. Rambo 2, First Blood. Um, I'm tied between Last Blood and Rambo. Because yeah. I gotta see it again. Last yeah. but I really yeah. love the ending. Oh my god, the, the ending, ending is, so is unfreaking believable. And then yeah. Rambo three is last, but I still, but yeah. I still like it for what it is. Are um, they leaving it open to do an like? No this? comment. No, okay. can't say that. Okay, okay. no yeah. comment. Last, I don't give away the whole movie. Because it's called Last Blood. You, you would no, think. No, no okay. comment. But I mean, you, you know, there is a First Blood part two. So that's what I'm saying. It yeah. could be Rambo. like there the could, final, I mean, who knows? the final there Last Blood. Last Blood. Seriously though, the last Last Blood. Yeah, no comment. You have to see the movie. Yeah. I don't want to give away anything, but I will right. say this. Uh, did you guys have like flea markets where you guys lived, like, you know, those outdoor weird markets yeah, where people yeah, just bought yeah. yeah. yes. one here now. No, no, yeah. but I mean, like, the we're old kids. weird ones where yeah. you would like, they would sell machetes to 10 year olds. Nope. Nope. Okay. Nope. nope. So there was one in Pittsburgh that we would go to and it was by our house. It was called Trader Joe's. Buy this flamethrower. Yeah, totally. Yeah. So I went the one day and you like walk in. I mean, it's just weird people selling stuff. And the one guy was selling a Rambo knife. I was 12. Mm-hmm. And I was like, how much for the Rambo knife? And he was like, how old are you? And I was like, 12. He's like, cool. Uh, 20 bucks. And I was like, sick. So I get the Rambo knife. And a 12-year-old holding a Rambo knife. It's like a freaking broadsword, yeah, right. right? So I come home with the Rambo knife, oh and I'm like, God. Dad, I have the Rambo knife. He's like, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Give me that. Get Sleep in the hallway. <laughs> Jesus Christ. So about 10 years later, I'm like going off to college, and, and I was and I was looking through the basement, and my dad kept the Rambo oh, knife like great. somewhere in the basement. And I was like, Dad, could I take the Rambo knife to college? He's like, What have I told you about the damn Rambo knife? <laughs> Not taking it anywhere. It is still in my basement somewhere. I know that Rambo knife is alive and oh, well. So good. We gotta get your dad on the show. Oh, he'd love it.